Right. You know what I'm saying? But like, leave that man alone, bro. Hey, can we all just get along? That's just, yeah. <laughs> that's this, not, that's your, I really yeah. want. I really want. I don't want it to get to a situation yeah. where, we, where lives are lost or certain mm-hmm. things are happening. But um, I think he should have stood this one out. This is a very sensitive this, thing that's happening with his dad, mm-hmm. and he just needs to let just let, let it go and, and, and let his dad. You know, his dad a grown man. I feel like it. also, and I he's talented. Like, he could actually. Yeah, rap. he's talented. He he just he got style. I like I like how he dressed sometimes. Yeah, he's swag. Yeah, yeah, he's got swag. He got rock with him. And his his uh one of his friends, Kai Cash. That's my dog. Copy, copy. Yeah, right. Yeah, so I definitely I rock with him. So like you know, I just feel like. Yo, especially if you didn't grow up a certain way, like how we grew up with certain things or whatever, mm-hmm. don't do that. Mm-hmm. No disrespect to him or whatever, but we grew up a little differently mm-hmm. <laughs> than how he grew up. So. Especially with 50. So yeah, like- especially when you're dealing with somebody <laughs> like that. <laughs> yeah, you got to remember who you're dealing with right who now. Could make, who, who could make things, whether it's through in the industry mm-hmm. or streetwise potentially, can make things uncomfortable for you right. with literally one phone call. Mm-hmm. Could blackball you, and especially with the things your dad going through right now, your dad can't help, can't stop you from getting blackballed. Right, you think? Because right now he's doing his own shit or whatever. Whether yeah. whether you on one side or the other, that's a whole nother topic altogether. But sometimes, man, especially younger artists or whatever, I think we, I I, I know it's personal for him, but sometimes and I'm pretty sure somebody told him, yo, don't put that out. Mm-hmm. I'm sure somebody told him, yo, leave that alone. But sometimes we let our ego get in the way of like our common sense. Mm-hmm. I think it's a circumstance. It's, 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 it's a circumstance. circumstance. It's, it, it's bothering him a lot. Like, you know yeah, what I'm saying? But I mean, like, coming he, at Diddy, for a long time. Coming at him hard. If I'm going to address you, I'm going to address you in a different type of way. Yeah. Not just, but I'm going to say he's not that type of person or mm-hmm. whatever. So this is where you, uh, uh, I, mean, I would have went ahead and did it and never put it out. But at the same time, it's kind of like I feel like it's a good marketing plan for it's him. It's a good marketing plan for, for him. People watching it for him. You know why I but, say no? I say that. Why you say that? Because I feel like because I seen an interview when they was asking Diddy about uh, Fifty and stuff, and he was sitting there in the cut, just quiet, like mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying. So I feel like everybody wanted to see that. Wanted to see him say something. Uh, and he least, finally did. He finally did. Boy it. got some bars though. The boy got talent, man. Mm-hmm. So it's like, shout out to him, man. But uh, let's not let it get further than that, though. Let's yes, sir.